Leon to the show you my vintage watercolor Photoshop action effect. How to use it and custom it. And uh, introducing some layer. How to custom all the layer. This is our previously apply effect. You can use any type of photo, animal. Maybe I am fashion art, animal art, dog. Okay, now first go my download file, the will show brush file, hell file, pattern file, and our script print this pattern color. So also with the hell file, there is some information include how to work pattern and uh, how to use Photoshop action? There is some instruction. Please follow this. And uh, there is on photo download link. And there. Now uh, I first load the brush, then load pattern, then load action. How to load pattern and brush? Select load and pattern. Control keyboard control and select two or you can manually select one and open it right button click select and right button click open then photoshop is pop up that means it is loaded then again right button click the pattern option and open then automatically load it in photoshop default now we have to load our action right button click and open now it's loaded our action plate. If not the show action plate, go window and action plate click and show there uh, there our vintage water color. And this is the play all in one play action play. And there is our on photo. You can open your photo. I open this one. Make sure your photo is a better quality, uh, high resolution. I, um, make sure the photo is a lock icon show lock background layer there is lock icon sometimes some images look like this this is not acceptable action not working properly so right button if your photo is look like this so right button click and fit an image now it's set a lock background layer and make sure your photo is a rgb color mode if not then go image mode with the rgb color and now if you use CC 2015.5, there is on option include for your software. Um, you click there and click selection to select the subject. Now automatically select your subject. Okay, now create a new layer. Just click there, new layer. If not show window, new uh, layer option. Go window and layer click. Now show there and double click the text layer 1. And type text B R E U S S. Just same my spelling. All are small letter. Now, okay, click on that side. And now I select the brush tool. Any soft brush in the top or a hard brush that is your choice. And click there and select that any light color. I need to some bigger. You can up and down there. Brush area, make sure you brush the brush layer. Oh. Uh, if you think you use the full area, then you can do the full area, or if you think uh, like this one, the half option and half option, only portrait, this is full area, and there is portrait. So that is your choice. And now I show you the full area. So I just fill out the full area. Pin bucket tool. Okay. Control D for deselect. And if there any area is anything to modify, you can modify it and make sure your brush layer is brushes. And now we need to some space for top, left, right, left, right, enough space. But now this time my this photo is not enough space for top. So I just drag and drop top. Just drop tool and drop 
October. Okay. And check out our image resolution size at last minimum 400 pixel or 300 pixel at last for better result. You can use any size of photo for at last 300 uh, pixel plus. Any high resolution use uh, photo is welcome. And hit the play button now start working Hello there, action is done working now. You can custom there. Okay, and view this and there is a, I show now there is a um, more black option show. So how can we remove this? Uh, sometimes some photo look like this, but how can we remove this? Now I introducing all everything. This is our main option and click there, the hidden option and find out this layer select there the max option and sub brush select just click there your noise area see it's automatically removed uh, then need to others just click the place okay. now it's uh, fine and get looking Now our introducing a layer, this is the back option, the back I stop, if your photo is the, if you remove area, see the back option, this is the back, so I return again, top color is white and brush there, now it's return again. And there is extra option. If you use uh, this, then the top option is uh, there, but then you can remove the face, make sure top color is black if you remove and select the max layer. Now, as again, see. Okay, this is another style. Uh, and uh, we use this one with the extra fill. And there is another option the top. And uh, this is the photo shading option. And this is the outline. Photo outline option. See the outline. And there is the shading. And this is the paper loop. Okay, uh, this option is done now. There is the another option if you use this one for real color, to photo real color. And now this is the vintage looking, and if you want to only for your photo focus, uh, option is the, the real color. Then you can use this one, and also you can select there the max option and remove some option for uh, natural looking purpose. <coughs> extra dynamic looking purpose. See, now make great looking. And uh, there is the another great, uh, great tone shading. If you think you can use it, the, the red shading. Now I just use this one and on this one. And this is the photo shading. You can use it if you uh, like this. And I and you just see the result. Or if you don't like the some area, then you can brush and remove it easily. Okay. So. Okay. And there is the adjustment. Check out all adjustment. 
and you can combine uh, two or three. Same uh, vector. Okay, I'm going to just unmute. Side blow. Okay, this one. This is the outside border. Like this border, you can, if you use this one, the photo is not top. We are top is facing here, and that's why it's face the body. If you are doing that, it's set. See. There is three of three option and color adjustment. If you use this the real color, then you can use another one. And also you can combine the looking, combine the color. You combine. Thanks for seeing this video and watching this product. Still, if you need any kind of help. You can send the message my social Facebook fan page Amara Studio, and uh, you can visit our new site there. This uh, there is all product are free for the action and others brush. You can download their free all product are free. Photoshop action.net.